All right. Now we're doing free code camp, JavaScript algorithms and data structures beta. Learn basic JavaScript by building a role playing game. SIP 68. All right. So now we're going to update our go store function to call the update function. We're going to pass the second element of the locations array as our argument. To make sure that we're re pardon me, that we are refactoring, pardon me, to make sure that our refactoring is correct, we're going to try clicking the first button again. It should sit, pardon me, we should see the same changes to our web page that we saw earlier. All right. So we're going to be going to go store. And as we know, go store is the second one here, which is index one, right? So what all we got to do here is just take this 50 up to the end of 49, copy that, drop it off right here, and then we'll just change this to one. Whoa, 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 whoa. we'll change this zero to one like this, right? So now to test this, we don't have to do any kind of console.log. All we got to do is go to the store now. Now we're in the store. All right. It says buy 10 health. I mean, pardon me, buy 10 health, buy weapon, blah, blah, blah. And then if we go back to town, Oh, we're back to town because of this one. So we check, we click it and it does this stuff, which does this stuff, which accesses this stuff. And then when we click this one, when we click this one, it does this thing, update at locations at zero, which does this stuff by accessing this stuff, all right? And that's how we make it work without repeating ourselves over and over and over and over and over again, right? So there's that, let's uh, check the code. Looks good and submit it. All right. Now we're on to step 69 and we'll see you next time.